All right, good afternoon, you guys. I'm Hi. Scott Horowitz, Director of Advertising at Crackle and PlayStation. Thank you for having us in. It's good to see you guys over here at Saatchi. I know that you guys are long-term fans of Crackle, and we're here to talk to you about some updates there as well as PlayStation. So I want to kick it off with a little bit of a rapid fire for you guys and just ask a few questions, and then we'll dive into the presentation. So question for you. Who, who knew the terminology of CTV maybe like three, four, five years ago? Did you guys use that terminology? No? No. Not really, huh? Maybe in like the last year. Right. Okay. And do you have any kind of connected TV device in your household today? I do. You do? Mm -hmm. Do you have a cable subscription? I do. Are you in your 20s? Yes. Yes. And how about you, Amanda? <laughs> I have a Roku and a connected TV and a PlayStation. Great. And I also have cable. You do have cable. And I cut the cord. And you are out of your 20s, right? I am just The personal question, but it's, but it's okay. <laughs> All right, good. These are good things to know as we kind of dive into this. We're, um, as you guys can imagine, before I jump into this, I just want to explain a little bit about how you know this as well. The TV landscape is changing. It's changing daily. It's um, something that we all have our pulse on, especially as advertisers, because we're trying to reach a very hard to find audience, especially those 18 to 24 and sometimes 34 year olds that are starting to cut the cord. Um, and we'll dive into some of the numbers about what they're doing and what percentage of them are doing and how they're replacing that with connected TV. So, um, Crackle users, yes? You guys have used Crackle. You've certainly bought advertising on the platform, so I just yeah. want to double check that. I watched mm -hmm. The Chosen Show. It was good. Oh, great. Very good. Yeah. Glad. That was one of my favorites. Before I started, I sat down and uh, did a little binge watching myself of three seasons. We're really excited about season four. I know you guys are as well because yeah. we're looking to do an integration with you that we owe you, so we'll talk a little bit more about that. All right. So I'm going to roll a quick clip here for you guys to give you a little bit of background on us. There's that. Keep on going. All right, so when we look at this slide, we really want to kind of make sure that you guys are up to speed on the breadth of the whole Sony portfolio. So we are a studio and a network. We're a studio and that we're a functioning studio. We're here on the lot in Culver City. We have motion pictures being made. We have television shows. We have a, um, a music business as well. And then our streaming uh, product, which of course is Crackle, and then also PlayStation. So Big things to remember and know here is that the television um, shows that we're producing, like Breaking Bad and Blacklist and Shark Tank, um, long-term uh, soap operas that have been on the air, like Young and the Restless for many years, those are all made out of Sony Pictures Television hit shows like Seinfeld. Um, our music division is doing great things, and we have programs like Playing It Forward that have launched on Crackle, where we have partnerships there with those guys. Big franchises in the movie business like Spider-Man and, and um, the, the Bond series, which we have a new film coming out in November. Um, then, of course, all the great shows that have been launching on uh, Crackle and original programming that we're getting into. So we'll talk a little bit about like that. And then we're doing original uh, programming on PlayStation as well. And that does fold into our whole um, data set, which you'll see some numbers on a little bit later. So that just gives you a little bit of a background on the Sony portfolio and how we play best in practice with all parts of the company. So... As our audiences migrate to digital platforms, 40% um, of homes now use a subscription video on demand um, platform. So whether that be a Netflix or a Hulu or an Amazon Prime um, or a Crackle for that matter. The benefit to Crackle is uh, also 13, sorry, 13% 13 use have two of those in the home. So 40% one, two have, 30% uh, have two. So you, two. you use two, okay. Yeah. Great. Mm -hmm. So we're, we're seeing those numbers, especially, um, again, among those millennials, 18 to 34, they have two plus um, subscriptions. They're not afraid of that, especially as they continue to cut the cord. So um, uh, as I actually forgot what I was doing here. So, um, shoot, how do you stop this thing? 